Am I really gonna do this? Alright, hey guys, it's Austin here from Mountain Entertainment, and I am here to talk about a topic that I just was like, I think I should address this. Okay, let's zoom in. Oh my hair. Oh my beautiful Goldilocks. Oh yeah. Alright, so, you guys saw the title. Hopefully. I don't know. So, I am here to dis- why are you- Hey, my eyes are up here. Uh, I am here to discuss subbotting, sub buying, whatever you want to call it. So, it's happened to this channel. Did I do it? Or did someone else do it? Or was it a group effort thing? Alright, so a little backstory on this channel. I created it in August 2014. I think I started on the 15th. And this was going to be a group channel, not with Joseph. It was going to be a group channel between me and this uh, girl named Gwen. She went to my school. We were friends for a few years. And we were going to have this channel together, kind of. It was started out as Mountain Entertainment or Mountain Craft. And that was where we were going to start. So we were going to do Minecraft videos. She ended up deciding after I created the channel that she didn't want to do it, I guess. And we never really did anything on a video together, I don't believe. And I was going to ask Joseph, but I don't remember exactly why. But... This was when I was leaving the school where Joseph, Gwen, and them were. And I was going to this new school that I had nothing, I didn't really know anything about. My cousin went there, and that was about it, that I knew about the school. And then, so that was kind of the reasoning for me to start the channel. I was, I didn't have any friends there. I didn't know anyone. I had no friends. No, I knew any, no one. Well, I didn't know two people. They went to the same school I did when I went to school with Joseph. One went earlier, like a few years before we all did, and then a kid moved at the same time I did. And he, we all went to the same school. Uh, but we weren't very... We weren't friends before. And we had the same class in eighth, seventh, eighth grade. And that's kind of when we became friend friends. But that I had some kinda kinda not. And so that was kind of two thousand fifteen spring break was the or eighth grade two thousand fifteen spring break was kind of when I started uploading off more often. I filmed a bunch I because I stayed home. I lived miles away from the school that I went to, so I didn't go hang out with people. I lived in the same town as Joseph and where I went to school, because all my sisters still went to the same old school. And then, so that's when I started it, and by the end of the year I had some friends, pretty good friends, honestly, uh, but this is in about my friends. So, one of the kids found out it wasn't my friend uh, he found out about my channel I don't remember how um, and then he asked if he could be a part of it so I was like I'm trying to find friends and uh, like connect with people at the school and I was like yeah that's a great idea and he never actually uploaded to the channel I gave him passwords and stuff like that, which I probably should have never done. So, that summer, we went, the school ended, we were still kind of friends, but kind of not. Like, the kid I gave passwords to, to and stuff. And then, that summer, he messaged me and was like, hey, so I found this app, it's like... I ended up downloading it 
after this all happened to see if my channel was still getting, like, showed, I think? I don't remember what it was called. Then... But he didn't really tell me what it was, and I never knew what sub botting was or buying subs was. Because I was kind of new to this whole YouTube thing. I wasn't even uploading for a year. I didn't even have my channel for a year. And then he came along and was like, hey, let's try this. It'll probably help us. So I was like, oh yeah, like I was trying to grow the channel. Like anyone does when they're first starting out on this platform or any platform for that so I was kind of like well okay let's give it a shot I'll I'll try it out or let you do what you want and we'll try it out and I was kind of not hesitant about it I was like yeah let's do I wasn't like so what's it all about well, like will it have any negative effects or anything then I think it was at the end of June, the channel shot up in subscribers. I think we hit like 4,500, almost 5,000 I think. And I was like, oh wow, that's amazing that we get in that much in less than a year or over a year, however long it was. I don't remember exactly when this thing blew up. but came to find out someone that subscribed to my channel through that app messaged me and asked for my Skype because he wanted to do a collab I don't remember his name I he was like so why were you on this app and he like told me about it and he's like yeah it's where you go to buy subs and I didn't know anything about it so I was like yeah I had someone else in the kind of the group of the channel well two of us and he was like yeah let's try this out and I like explained it to him all and I was like then he explained to me kind of what it was and then I started researching it on my own finding out what sub botting was and all that stuff so it turns out he actually bought these coin things that so you like give them like so if they subscribe to your channel they get like five coins and then whoever then they can use that it's like their currency kind of so if I subscribe to this channel over here and they're offering four coins if I subscribe to them then that four coins goes into my account then I can offer four coins to anyone or however much I wanted and it was a way to grow your channel and I started kind of researching this and finding out how bad it was and that it can get you in kind of some trouble. And then I was like, yeah, I kind of like told the guy, let's not do this anymore. And then he got all upset and left, which I was kind of glad about because I was only the one that putting in work a little bit here and there to the channel. Like I never really uploaded very often. I did consistently for a little bit there, and then I was kind of gone from the channel for about six months or less than six months, I think. Might have been exactly six months, though, because I stopped when school started up again, and then I started once I got my setup at my old house. And then... So, that I haven't talked to that kid in however long. And then, because he didn't go back to our school after 8th grade. In ninth grade, I started doing homeschooling like halfway through the year. And he wasn't there the rest of, or the year that I was in ninth grade for the half the year I was there. So I was like, okay, he's gone. Oh, well, good. And then, I do honestly regret it. Um, that's why I don't do like subscribers like... Thank you guys for 4,160. I think that's where we are now. But in the last few weeks or so, the channel has been blowing up, guys. Not like extremely, but it was like, I hate that it says 4,000. 
If I could, I would reset it, but you can't. And I honestly wish I would have never had anyone join me on my YouTube channel. Like, I've done so much by myself, and I consider it successful so far. Even though we're not pulling in billions of views a year. And millions of subscribers, I still kind of find it successful. So... I would never recommend doing this sub botting, sub buying, whatever it is. It'll destroy a channel, I think. Because then you get all those people that subscribe just to get those coins or whatever, like on that one app. Then, once they realize you, your channel, what it is really, they also unsubscribe. I had that hit my channel very badly once. And we lost a bunch. And I started to realize it's not all about the numbers. Like, it is kind of, but it's really not. You don't need all the numbers to be successful on here. And this last few weeks, I've been, I don't know why, but I've been thinking about it. And it's been bugging me, and I was like, the channel's been getting a lot of support lately, and... All that, and I don't know exactly, but I think it's better to have this out there in on the channel. Who knows how long this will be up. It might just come down in 24 hours or something. So, it was like a horrible point when I figured out what it really was. And I not been on that I've download re-downloaded it to make sure my channel wasn't um still getting promoted on there. I always go on there. I always like I don't even have it downloaded right now on my phone. I download it occasionally just to make sure it didn't get reactivated to be promoted. Um but if you guys are ever gonna start a channel with someone or have someone come on the channel. Don't give them your passwords and stuff right away. Uh, have them record things or something and send them to you and you can upload them or whatever. Then, and if you do start a channel with someone, make sure it's someone you trust. I really wish I would have started this channel with Joseph or more people. Because me and Joseph are great friends, I think. And... I trust him a lot, and he trusts me to upload things to his channel sometimes, and I tr I would trust him 100% to upload to this channel. So, I have thought about restarting a channel and not telling anyone on this channel that I started a new one, just to see where I could get, but I think I'm going to keep this channel going. If it, I ever do, the name will probably change again to, like, mountain something or because I want to use the mountain entertainment uh, branding I guess for that new channel then so that's kind of where I am at, at this moment with this channel what's this okay that was weird uh, it was like shiny and I didn't know what it was but I am really Thankful for what you guys are helping me with. Like, we got a hundred views on a video this week on Sunday. I think that's Sunday's video. And we hit over a hundred views in about less than 48 hours. I think it was less than, it was a little more than 24. But that was freaking amazing to me, guys. It was, really was. And we've been gaining subscribers. And I really appreciate it, guys. That's one reason I wish I could restart the subscriber thing. And because I want to have like a real number on there. But to know how many people I have subscribed to this channel. But you can't from what I found out. You might be able to. I don't want to delete this channel. I want to keep it going as long as I can. And... I have some stuff planned. Actually, I got a box for the truck. Not a box, but a box of parts over there. 
I'll show you guys. I got those yesterday. But you guys won't see that for a few days because the day you guys are seeing this or tomorrow. I think tomorrow after this video goes up, I'm getting the other part that needs to be a part of that. And I've already released what I was doing on uh, a video. I think it was the farming simulator work mowing. I think. But I'm going to go grab that box real quick, or a part out of that box, and show you guys. So, I'm going to keep this going. I'll be right back. Here it is. It's a brand new headlight housing for the 6L. It does have bulbs in it already, as you can tell. But I'm not gonna use these. I ordered some from Oxbeam. Some LED ones that should be here Friday. But you guys won't see this video until probably next Thursday. Because I have next Wednesday and Thursday off from work. And those are the only days I have off this next coming week. I'm recording this on Wednesday. And this is my last day off for this week. So I won't have time to install those probably. I could probably install them next Tuesday. But I'll just wait until Wednesday. Just in case there is an issue with them. I can kind of address it and I'll have time to edit it that's one of the big problems editing these those kind of videos they take time and if I don't have enough time in the day you guys won't see that video especially with work and stuff um, but I really appreciate it guys uh, how much you guys are helping this channel out and I won't ask for money. Well, maybe I will. Like, if I ever need it, I might. But I doubt that I will. Because I've got a job. I'm making all right money a month. And I'm pretty well off right now. So, I'm going to continue grinding on this channel. I won't stop for a while. I won't sub bot or view bot or whatever bot there is. Like, it, I really do hate that that happened. Like, it's mostly my fault for trusting someone with this channel. And, yeah, so this, I might feel better after uploading this video. I might not. I'm not sure yet. But, who knows? It might help. It might not. It might just bring more hate. Like, I know when I first started uploading again in suit. January or February or January of 2016 I got a lot of hate because there were people saying I sub it and I always denied it but I'm coming out with that and saying yes this channel was was it directly me that did it no but was I part of it technically yes so that is it for today guys I'll see you hopefully tomorrow Monday there might not be a video. I got a 12 hour shift I gotta work which I'm not looking forward to. But, yep, that is it for today. I'll see you guys next time. I hope you guys have a great rest of your Thursday. I'll see you guys next time. Just don't sub bot guys. It'll ruin your channel. Like, I don't know. I've been wanting to create another channel, but I never did. So this is kind of my message to you guys. Just grind on it, your channel, work on it hard, and you should make it somewhere. You might not make it to 10 million in a few years, but you might make it there if you keep working on it. But that's my best advice for you guys, coming from a channel of 4,000. 4,000. I really want to know how many people are actually subscribed that watch every day or watch occasionally. But, yeah. Bye.